are on our way to our destination, which is Ludington, Michigan. We are both very, very tired. And you could say that our excitement is very low right now. <laughs> uh, but so far, so good. We got everything done that we needed to get done for this first trip. We got another four hours to go. We left town around 3.30 and we got to Ludington KOA around 10.30 just in time for the fireworks to go off. So we had to park behind the building and we pulled out our chairs and had a drink and watched fireworks, which were really good. Staff was super awesome. And then they drove us in their golf cart over to our site. We have noticed a few things that we have run into. Um, our electrical just like was on when we were on the road. So like all of a sudden I look back and I noticed the lights are on in our Airstream. And I'm like, what's going on? Cause he had turned the battery off or so we thought, oh, but our Airstream is not haunted. It is just uh, electrical stuff. When the AC is doing some things, it, uh, <laughs> that's all I know. The AC, it, uh, <laughs> I'm so tired. The AC, when it kicks into like a different motor, it's gonna go like ultra cool, like the lights flicker. That's fun. Also, we have no curtains whatsoever. All of our, all, except for this one right here in the kitchen, the one that we need least. So, Shut up. I have an eye mask, so, I I have an eye mask, so it'll block out all, all the light. Going uh, all I feel like maybe you think this all completely through. I think you might be right. <laughs> but this was just the first dry run, you know? Uh huh. So what happens when you're wiring it until five minutes before you leave. And we have no food, so we're just gonna eat some snacks for dinner. But yeah, we're thankful to be here. Super fun, we're glad we finally got this thing on the road. And we're gonna go to bed and uh, tomorrow is a new day. Hopefully we can solve some of these problems. All right, good night. had a fantastic day today we were able to sleep in a little bit and then we got up and did some you know housekeeping around the airstream and then we headed into town it's like 30 minutes away from here hit uh let's see walmart and myers and a gas station and got some lunch at wendy's and then came back here and did some more housekeeping stuff we had to flush our fresh water tank and clean it out we had to hook up the sewer. What else did we do? Oh, hung up um, blinds on our windows. What else did we do today? Ooh, what else did we do today? We tested some of our mobile internet stuff. We got our dual antennas out with our hotspot. Plug those in. Um, oh yeah, hooked up our um, electrical monitoring system so we could see what's going on at the pedestal from inside wirelessly. Mm -hmm. That was kind of cool and uh, a, lot of, a lot of water stuff. Mess with a lot of, a lot of tank flushing and uh, line flushing, but uh, yes. yeah, made, made a lot of progress. And then we hooked with our Blackstone for the first time. And it turned out great. It's delicious. Delicious. Now we're gonna clean up and have a campfire so we can burn these four bundles of wood we got last night that we didn't touch because we're leaving tomorrow. It's a very, very short trip. We had to cut it a day short um, on the front end because we weren't ready to go yet. We we're supposed to get here on Friday. We got here on Saturday night. So really it just feels like we've been here 
one one full day because that's what we've been here for but it was a really good um, learning experience and a good first trip all in all it went really really smoothly we have done a lot of preparation watching a ton of videos and doing a bunch of research so i don't feel like we're total newbies in that i think it's time for us to enjoy a fire kick back and relax head to bed We have reached the end of our, I guess, second night here, and Gorn is about to get into the shower and see how it goes. <laughs> oh, shit. So our shower is janky. What's new? The faucet won't turn off completely. So anytime we're hooked up to city water or the water pump is on, the shower is leaking. But we put a new shower head on and we bought a new faucet. We just didn't have time to do it before we left. So this is gonna be the very first shower, the inaugural shower. It's gonna be great. How was your shower? Oh my God, greatest shower of all time. It was so good. No, like, like, so. <laughs> <laughs> greatest shower of my uh, RV camping. It's your first and only experience. shower. <laughs> <laughs> but so far. Flawless system, very clean. I Once we get that faucet fixed, it's gonna like be great. A, like a fresh Irish spring. <laughs> you look like good. a fresh, come to bed, it's time for bed. Okay, okay good. Shut down the TV studio, it's cut, so then print it. Okay guys, we're going to bed, we'll see you in the morning. Good night. Oh, good night. <laughs> going to test out the gas propane on running this on the way home. So we've got some ice cream, some ice and an ice pack in the freezer. And it's currently at nine degrees. Fridge has some condiments and milk and is currently at 49 degrees. It never really got much cooler all the way down to where we want it to be. So we're gonna so test that on the way home. DC will be on, so make sure you got all the lights on. Okay. Um, yeah, we're ready to roll. All right, great. We made it home safe and sound. It took us about, I don't know, eight and a half hours. There was a ton of traffic today. I forgot why we don't travel the day after the 4th of July. Um, it's horrible, but we got home safe. Everything is golden. Ella is back in her home. Let's take a look. One more thing before we sign off. I wanted to check on the fridge and freezer and see how well they did on the gas on the way home. All right, it's still on. Yeah. Hey, we still have ice. All right, 14 degrees it looks like. That's good. And for the fridge. 60, so that one did not stay super cold. I feel like the fridge was one of the few disappointments that we had on this trip. All in all, great first trip. We worked out some kinks. We figured out some things that we need to do, some things we need to not do. I am disgusting and sweaty, and I really need to shower, so I'm gonna go do that. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button. Lots of adventures for you coming right up very, very soon. All right, see you later.